monitoring your Newtonics hyperconverged infrastructure with Psi 247. With processors, memory, and storage integrated within the VM and significantly bringing down latency levels, Newtonics harmonizes operations across multiple platforms. In this video, we'll show you how you can add Newtonics clusters, hosts, and VMs for monitoring and discuss the metrics that come with them. To monitor your Newtonics resources, you'll need on-premise Polar, a lightweight agent that discovers the Newtonics resources in your network. Ensure that the chosen on-premise Polar has access to your Newtonics environment. In the Site 24-7 console, navigate to Admin and then click Newtonics Monitoring. Provide a display name and enter the host name or IP address of the server on which Newtonix is running. Mention the port on which the Newtonix cluster is listening and enter the Newtonix PRISM credentials. Choose the frequency at which the resources are to be monitored and select on-premise polar from the drop-down. Once you select the monitor group and the dependency monitors, toggle to yes to discover every Newtonix host and virtual machine in the cluster. After associating the appropriate configuration profiles, click Save. The discovered resources will be listed under the Newtonics tab. The Newtonics tab is disabled by default. Click Edit at the bottom of the web console to enable it. When you click on a Newtonics cluster, you will see a summary of the storage details, the hardware summary and an in-depth view into the disk usage which will tell you the amount of physical storage space used in the cluster, the rate of data transfer, and the average time taken by the disk to process I.O. requests. Similarly, you can see granular details for content cache and storage controllers, which helps in capacity planning for your storage requirements across resources. Monitoring the Acropolis hypervisors supporting the VMs is critical in identifying the performance bottlenecks at the hypervisor level. Tracking key performance metrics such as input and output operations from the hypervisor, the rate of data transfer, and the latency in the hypervisors lets you right-size your HCI. Is a particular VM taking up a large amount of resources? This can be determined by monitoring VM-specific resources such as storage capacity, storage space available, virtual disks, virtual NICs, the disk capacity of the VMs and their IOPS rate. This helps to ensure that all the VMs share adequate resources so that one VM isn't hogging all the resources. Correlate the metrics across clusters, hypervisors, and VMs by creating a custom dashboard to understand the impact of performance problems and pinpoint the root cause. This is how Psi247 helps in monitoring the complex Newtonics HCI environment and eliminates the need to switch between tabs to view critical metrics.